Lunchtime. Got myself a nice healthy lunch. Got some brown granary bread. Got some lettuce there. A couple of bits of ham. Some cheese and some mayonnaise. Welcome to Thursday. It's a lovely sunny day outside today and hopefully it will last. Yesterday I put all my towels up to dry and they got absolutely soaked when it rained. So I've had to bring them all in and we washed them. So I've got those out to go out today. So hopefully things will cross our dry. Heading off to the gym later on this afternoon. And see comes home from work. My sister, she's going to join us as well. So yes, that's what we've got planned for today. Really nothing special. Um, but we'll keep you updated for our day out now on the line hopefully it's gonna dry now upstairs to do the horrible tasks of sorting out all the socks that's one thing I hate doing I normally leave it to Stephen to do because I hate doing that and also need to put all the boys clothes away I'm trying to teach Sammy to put his clothes away he just says it's throw them in his drawers and they end up all creases it's just not worth doing that one so yes that's what I'm doing next Have a nice healthy lunch. Got some brown granary bread, got some lettuce there, a couple of bits of ham, some cheese, and then some mayonnaise. So that is my lunch for today. Then I got something nice and healthy, and <laughs> Stephen hasn't. Stephen has got some square sausage and some waffles cooking in the oven for his lunch. Is my washing drying today? Let's have a look. Yeah, it's drying quite nicely actually. Anyway, I'm going to show you over here. Remember I said we've planted our seeds. Well, I've got this, this rampy thing here. As you can see, they started to grow slightly, which is great. Obviously, they're the bean seeds in there. God, I think we've planted in there actually. A few things are growing in there as well. So, yeah, that's her shadow when we get home. Obviously I want you to walk them at the minute she can because obviously we had late the last couple of days had loads and loads of rain. I don't want them too much because apparently the seeds can wet rot or something. My dad was saying you need to get them too wet. I'm not too quite sure the sunflowers down here are growing yet. See if I like the sunflowers down here. 
No, they're not growing yet, are they? Sunflower seeds aren't. Oh, no. But obviously, like I said, I can't believe the grass is grow how much the grass has grown since we cut it last. We're planning on also we're planning on doing is in the next few weeks we're gonna try and attempt to get this tree stump up a little bit little bit by little bit. My dad's got an axe here so we could borrow. So we're gonna try and get an axe on it, get it down, and then in that corner over there we're putting my Christmas tree in. It's over there she's it's growing a bit and my dad's it's ready for the ground. So I'm gonna go get in that corner there. No, it looks good because there's a bit of a gap just there as well. So I hope that fill that gap up as well for the Christmas tree. So yeah, the sun's out, which is nice. I think when the sun's out, it makes everyone feel a lot happier, I think. Obviously that is a job to do as well. Take all this lot up to the tip. I probably might do that one day next week, I think. Oh, we're just off to the gym now for an hour. It's one of those days where I can't be, can't be bothered, you know what I mean? But I know I've got to force my... I know. The thing is, once you've been to the gym, it's something to do with the endorphins that makes you feel happy. But once you're there, you're fine. You go and then you work out, you feel good. It's just find that motivation to go to the gym, you know what I mean? That's what we've lost over the last few years. We have actually. Hopefully, once this new gym is built, it's windy in there. So, so hopefully, once this new gym is built, we'll get our motivation to go back. Because at the minute, it's been like all the wet equipment's all bundled into one corner, so to speak. And then you have to be careful then when you're doing the weights. But hopefully, what do you reckon? Well, they say about eight weeks. Eight, nine weeks, I reckon, it would be in the new, doing the new part. Because that's a swim point as well, so that would be ideal. Do an hour in, the, hour in the pool, an hour in the gym, even though I can't swim. So yeah, so hopefully it should be a good workout. So I need to do my workout on Tuesday. I don't know if I'm going to do any weights yet, I'll just do cardio. What depends on how busy it is. And then we'll get home, have a rest for an hour or so, and the kids will be home from school. See, the new gym is coming quite nicely now. People with the glass in there, aren't they? So it's going to look nice when it's done. And I can't wait to be honest with you. Like I said, hopefully get our motivation back. It's going for quite a while. It's going quite big in size, doesn't it? Really big in size. So yeah, so hopefully in six to eight weeks we should be in there. Well guys, as you can see just now, the leisure centre is coming on quite well. It's still got the glass frontage on on the top where the gym's going to be. So it's going to be strange when you're working out and, uh, you know, looking out into Brackley, you know. Someone could be down there with a camera looking at you and filming you while you're going... Yeah, it'll be on YouTube, it'll be here on that vlog. It's been so strange to get upstairs, go to the gym. Not being nasty, guys, that ever since that gym has had this renovation work being done, it's taken, what, two and a half years now to get where it has done? Yeah. It's basically thrown a lot... I know we're not the only ones. It's thrown a lot of people away from there. And basically, a lot of people have lost their motivation to push themselves and work out, haven't they? I don't know, we're watching the Ingram family at the minute. Oh, yeah, we're watching the... We just found the Ingram family on YouTube. Apparently, they've got nearly up to a million subscribers, haven't they? They have them, yeah. Yeah. Um, found a link to these via... The Freer family, I think, because the Freer family had it on their related channels on the top right hand corner. I think it's free. I think we found it free link through somehow anyway, didn't we? So. Yeah. So, anyway, hello to the Ingram family anyway, if, you, if you're ever going to watch one of our films. I doubt it, but. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, what was I saying about the gym? Yeah, two and a half years that gym has been, just to get that little bit done on the gym's taken two and a half years. And uh, we were told that. Because we've been a long time member that our su subscription to the gym will not go up because they can't touch us because we were part of the old uh, no, on the old contracts with uh, what was the name of the old Circo, wasn't it? Circo, Circo yeah. So the, old, the new gym price is about £42 a month. Yeah. But because we're on the old £20 a month contracts, we still pay £20 a month for a brand new gym and everything else. Yeah, so we'll be able to use the swimming pool and everything. And all the classes. And all the classes and everything. All so. the saunas and the hot tubs. <laughs> I don't want to let the, let the gym go because, you know, it just gives you that bit of motivation to try and work out. But the only problem I've got up there, guys, with that gym is that the uh, equipment they use is, is used by Precore. Precore, is it? Cheryl, Precore weight equipment? Yeah. 
Yeah. It's, it's not very good, you know. I'm going to have to say that right away. That equipment I got up there is uh, it's it's basically rubbish, you know, because basically one of, one of the gym instructors up there has basically said that a lot of people have maxed them out on the weightage, and a lot of the stuff is quite loose when you're touching it and wobbling. I know. Yeah. There's like the uh, like the leg press. You try to get your legs in there. It's like it's like you feel like you're crunched up in a sardine can. Me, I can't use it because I'm small. Yeah. It's not very good. Not a very good weight equipment, but the the cardio equipment is spot on. And uh, when they finally get it all shifted and everything's upstairs and all going to be nice and all done, they're going to have actually got TV going to be on those things, aren't they? <laughs> If I have to say anything about that old equipment they used to have from Serco there, it was a lot better, it was much better and you know you could work out better. There was like a back press type thing where you laid up against the thing and basically pushed yourself backwards and now on these new ones it's just got like this little horrible pad in it. It's like you can't get comfortable in it, you know, it's like it's very very poor equipment up there for the weight side. How do you find the actual weight? It's not too bad actually, I use the free weights, I use free weights anyway, don't I? Yeah. I lift 10, 15 kilograms of free weights, it's just easier for me, so... Yeah. Anyway guys, uh, we've had a few questions on under the vlogs about how, you know, what do we film on? Basically we just film on our phone, don't we Joel? It's basically, basically our Galaxy S8 phone and it just shows you that you don't really need major equipment to record yourself to be on YouTube. The only reason why I'm not doing 4K is because basically these phones will swallow up the, the swallow up the megabytes just like that, wouldn't it? How long does it record? About 10 minutes, is it? The thing is, uploading that to YouTube will be a pain in the bum, I think. It's best to stay in HD and stay in HD for now until something mega happens. At the end of the day, um, the computer I've got over there is now, what, two years old? Two, three years old? And uh, basically, for the amount of vlogs we've recorded over the last 14, 15 months, I've swallowed up four expansion packs, or shall I say, the, uh, what are they called now? They're called, like, external hard drives, but they used to be called expansion packs. I've, I've swallowed up four of those, so there's so much footage now from us as a family over the last 15 months, isn't there? I know guys, I know some of the vlogs can be boring some days, but you know, we can't do something every day. We try to do something every day and show you everything, but it just can't happen, can it? The thing is, it's like I said, how do we carry on doing daily vlogs? It's just something we enjoy doing, it's a hobby. Yeah. I think if I get a vlog, I miss it. Yeah. It's just part of my routine and stuff like that. And you know what, I'd like to thank everyone for all their nice comments over the last, last few months under the vlogs. Um, we're going to start doing something called Comment of the Day, aren't we? We are, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to start doing that tonight. I'm going to do that now. I'm going to start doing it tonight on the first, today being the first vlog for a Comment of the Day. Okay. So I'm going to do a Comment of the Day before we close out tonight. And basically it's going to be a comment from yesterday's vlog. And Cheryl's going to pick out the best one. Yes. Yeah? And basically it acts as a shout out for whoever that is, yeah? Yeah. So yeah, so if you ever want to comment on the day, you have to comment on the video. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, if you want if you want if you want to comment on the day, comment on the video and basically keep giving us all the thumbs ups, the likes and everything, yeah. Also don't forget to share our channel as well because it'd be such an amazing if we could get to 5k before Christmas. Yeah, it would guys, yeah. I'll tell you what we've got coming up soon is Weymouth, as I told you recently. I'm going to be showing you some bits from last year as well, very soon, because uh, I know not many of many people were subscribed to us, were they, this time last year? What I might do is, I might put a Weymouth play, I might put in, in today's vlog... Yeah, a Weymouth playlist is there, yeah. I might put a Weymouth playlist in, the vlog, in today's vlog, yeah. so people can actually see if they want to. Yeah. And uh, anything else to add, Cheryl? That's it. Uh, yeah, comment of the day will be coming tonight, as long as we don't forget, because I know how silly we can be. <laughs> and uh, the boys will be home in about, what, about an hour or so? Yeah, about an hour or so, won't they? Yeah. Um, there you go. 
There's the Ingram family. I don't know how many people. I don't know how many people on YouTube find it being an obsession now of watching YouTube every night instead of main TV. I do. I know it's becoming it's becoming an obsession. It's like YouTube is like people enjoy watching YouTube a lot now, don't they? Instead of normal things. <laughs> I tell you, I haven't watched EastEnders since Bradley fell off the roof of the Queen Vic, and that's been ages. <laughs> Coronation Street, I, I've i never watched that properly, have you? You've even gone off Neighbours as well, haven't you? Yeah, Neighbours got gone. It's quite funny, Sam and I is watching Emmerdale, but Dan's studying because Nanny watches Emmerdale. Yeah, but he doesn't, watch, he doesn't watch Emmerdale properly, does he? He just watches bits on YouTube. Watches bits on YouTube, yeah. So overpoweringly messy everywhere. Anyway, guys, uh, do you like watching soaps? Leave comments below, you know, it'd be nice to interact with things. And uh, uh, coming up this weekend, what are we doing this weekend? I don't know, yeah. Oh, not Warwick Castle again. I don't know, it's going to be, yeah, but I'm working Saturday, Sunday, the trains are all over the place. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see, guys. Uh, you know, it's just the time of the month again where, you know, you get all your. Your things going out and you have to afford them, don't you, Cheryl? Yeah. Uh, anyway, tomorrow's Friday. We are going to be off to Banbury. Got some things to do and uh, go and pick up the boys from school and go through those new ga fancy looking gates I've got at school. Hey. I'll tell you, for all the eight years I've been going there, you know, I never thought I'd see the day when there'll be gates like that there. It just, you know, they never even told you that that was going to happen, did they? No. I hate it. It's one of those chores. Well, guys, we'll see you when the boys come home in about an hour. And look look out for comment of the day coming up later. So Sammy and Stephen are just finishing off their tea. You all right, sweet Yeah. Have hey, a good day at school? Yeah. What are you doing at school today? They're doing the snacks. Language, lunch, about, I did, I did. What? I did. Snacks and, and so time. What do you do for teasing time? Well, you played outside. Shocked. You don't have the computer is outside over the computer, aren't you? Anyway, as you can see, Mr. Beebs isn't here. Let's go see where he is. I think I think we all know where he is. Um, and here he is. He's outside. On you, Ben. Yeah, here we go. Hi. Yeah, you've got half an hour out here, all right. Go something out here too long, it's getting a bit chilly. Okay, yeah. Yeah, two good days at school today, won't you? Wonder if we finish it off tomorrow the 3rd. Yeah? Yeah, two good days at school. Nice blue sky, but it's a bit cloudy, it's a bit dark over there. I'm hoping it doesn't rain. I said it's going to rain in the weekend, so I think we might plan to have to probably indoors, I think. Hey there, Ben. Nice and high, you can actually jump on there, to be honest with you. Well, guys, another vlog has come to an end, and as promised, it's now time for comment of the day. And here we go with our first ever comment of the day, and it goes to... Terrified? Terrified, if we said your name wrong. Terrified, and you can see it down the bottom here. It says, oh gosh, what a throwback, now it's like music 99. Can you um, believe it's going to be now 100 soon? I know, and it's quite scary, I've got most of, I've got most of the albums. Yeah. And I've even got some of the spinners, like now it's like called Disney, now they're called Running, haven't I? Yeah. I think I've got loads and loads of them now. So I could put, put it this way, I could do a vlog on all my Now CD collections. I bet you've got Now 1, have you? I've got Now 1. I, I think that was on LP, wasn't it? That was on vinyl. <laughs> vinyl. I think mine start from about Now 20, I think. Now 20, Now 21. Did you used to have any cassettes? Yeah, I used to have loads on cassettes. Yeah. So that is our comment today, guys. Um, Thank you to Terrify for your comment yesterday on this, on, to say, on the vlog you watched yesterday. Yeah. Um, so if you want to be comment of the day, just leave a comment below and then we'll... Choose the best one. Yeah, choose that. Yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching today, and we'll give you a. Oh, God, no, so. Like, comment, and subscribe. 
Thumbs up. Uh, and we'll see you tomorrow for Friday. For Friday tomorrow, yeah. yeah. Um, don't forget to like, I said, like, see so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and also share our channel. Um, Facebook we, along the bottom. We would love to get to 5k for the end of the year. And um, we promise if we get to 5k, we're going to do a special challenge where we're going to go to Primark, see who's clipping an outfit for me to wear. You're going to buy me tickets to Anfield to watch Liverpool play. Yeah, you and your dreams. <laughs> uh, so I was saying, so we're going to go to Primark. See if, it's good, see if you can get an outfit for me for ten pound. I can do the same. So that is our challenge. Well, we're going to have a date night, are we? <laughs> yeah, that'd be nice. That'd be anyway, happen. yeah. So that will be, that's our, that's what we're going to do when we get to five k. So please, I said, share our channels, but she should can. And so like I said, we'll see you tomorrow for Friday. Bye bye. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.